Thank you very much. This is a very Donald Trump plans to surrender to authorities in Georgia, the latest extraordinary step in a series of criminal indictments that will suck every ounce of oxygen from the first U.S. Republican primary debate held just hours before. The former president confirmed late Monday that he would turn himself into the county jail in Atlanta the day after the debate in Milwaukee, ensuring a spectacle that could dash his rivals' hopes of profile-boosting coverage. Can you believe it? I'll be going to Atlanta, Georgia, to be arrested by a radical left district attorney, Fanny Willis, who is overseeing one of the greatest murder and violent crime disasters in American history, Trump posted on social media. The runaway favorite for the Republican nomination is accused of leading a criminal enterprise to cling to power after his 2020 election defeat to Joe Biden, one of four criminal cases targeting him as he bids to return to the White House. He and 18 co-defendants, all of whom were charged under Georgia's racketeer-influenced corrupt organization's law, were given until Friday at noon to surrender. The order bans Trump, who is out on a $200,000 bond, from intimidating co-defendants or witnesses, including on social media. The former president had already announced that he would be a no-show at the Republican presidential debates.